So in this process, we want to make sure that we get very clear, visible pictures of all four corners of the home. And the reason we need to do that is to make sure for positioning of your array, to make sure that the home size, uh, the roofing, you can get a lot from the ground right here. So just make sure you take pictures. Um, you cannot take too many pictures. So I would recommend taking one vertical, one horizontal, and then just walk around the home and take it all the way around. So here we're gonna review the main panel. You're gonna take a picture, make sure we can see clearly all the amperage. We wanna be able to see the size. Um, that's very important. So once you've taken your clear picture, the next st stage of this process is to remove the cover to expose the wiring so that we can verify the type of wire that your home runs on to make sure that we uh, tap into it correctly. And while this is up, don't forget to take a picture of your paperwork as well. One last picture we will need for your meter is the actual numbers located on the meter that does need to get reported to your utility company. So make sure you get pictures of the whole rafter spacing. Make sure you get them all nice and clear. They need to see the board. They need to see the rafter type, the rafter spacing. So once again, the more pictures, the merrier. And then get your measurement. So sometimes two people is easier, but if you can't, try and get a picture as clear as you can. There we go. Perfect. Holding your breath definitely helps. And when you're up in your attic, if yours is like mine, where it's chock full of insulation, you can't see the floor, make sure you take your steps onto each beam so you're not stepping on your sheetrock. You wanna make sure that you're nice and safe. I'm sitting currently on mine. Um, and as you take your steps, just make sure you continue that as well. So for the last part of the site survey, what we're gonna do is we're gonna get up and we're gonna measure the roof where we wanna place the solar panels. And for this part, you are going to make sure you have your tape measure and something to mark your roof, whether that's a piece of chalk or I'm gonna use a pencil today. So what we're gonna measure, we're gonna measure from side to side, top to bottom, so that way we can get the height and then the width of the entire roof. 140 and a half. 140. So we've made our first mark across the roof, 22 feet. I'm gonna come back from this side. We're gonna be 13 feet, two inches. So we're gonna be 35 feet, two inches. So with your obstructions on mine, I'm gonna take this as one lump sum. This will be the start, this is gonna be my finish, and then the top's gonna to be over here. So we'll kind of block this whole section off of solar panels. Right. So now as you measure from your side, if you have any part that extends, do not forget to include that. This does have that additional 18 inches um, from where I measured at the top. You're gonna to notate here, um, you know, 16 feet, six inches. Make sure you write that down, take a picture of it, edit your picture from the bottom of your roof. 47, 46, 47. So after you take these measurements, there are two different ways that you can get them back to us. You can draw it on a piece of paper, just sketch it out, mark all the different parts of your roof, side to side, top to bottom, any obstructions, just notate distances on there for us. You could also take a picture if you're more digital 
take your picture, edit it with your phone, show, you know, with a different colored line where all those measurements come into place, and then send it in with your site survey. All right, folks, I want to thank you for joining us on this DIY solar panel adventure. Remember to hit that button if you found this video helpful. And if you have any questions or thoughts, drop them in the comments below. We're all about the community here at Solar Wholesale, and we're here to support you every step of the way. So go ahead, grab your toolkit, channel your inner DIY warrior, and let's make solar power a reality for your home. Until next time, stay powered up and keep on shining bright.